this is your boy Steph. I just wanted to update you guys as to why I haven't been posting regularly. Um, I just didn't feel motivated to post any video. Um, my thing is, if I don't have any video ideas to post or react to, I won't post. I feel as though when you are forcing videos and doing things just because you can't, I think your audience would be able to know the difference between faking a video and doing it because you truly enjoy it. That's one reason, that's one of the main reasons why I haven't been posting. Um, as we know that Roast Me Season 5 will be ending soon. And by the time I post this, Episode 7 will have already been posted already. We will have one more episode and that will be the finale, the season finale. I will post that on my main channel, Steph Reacts. But, um, you should be able to see Roast Me Episode 7 on my second channel called Steph Plugs. I will put a link in the description so you guys can see it. But, I now have two channels right now. But, I just would like to say that I really appreciate all of the support and everything. And, I am truly grateful you guys have changed my life in such a short period of time i never knew that i was going to gain this much views and subscribers so kudos to you guys for holding it down and i really appreciate it for you guys who do not know i am from the caribbean i am from the bahamas so if you do hear a accent just know that that is my accent i have a caribbean accent I have a Bahamian accent. So that is the main questions I've been getting in the comments. But I do appreciate the positive comments and I do enjoy reading them. Um, I cannot remember the name of this guy, but he told me to react to one of his channels doing a roast me and a with it I guess it's a roast me video with him and his friends I will post the video so please be on the lookout I will I did react personally to one of the videos I did enjoy it so I do think that everyone else will enjoy it as well so thank you for letting me know that um I do not have any other details to share with you guys other than that oh yeah Congratulations to the Golden State Warriors for winning their championship against the Boston Celtics. I did have the Warriors winning in Game 7, but I wasn't surprised that the Warriors won in Game 6 based on the fact that the Boston Celtics played horrible and they just never find their goof. But, um... Still, I, I still appreciate the Boston Celtics fan nonetheless that because they made it thus far. Nobody had them beating the Brooklyn Nets and nobody had them beating the Milwaukee Bucks. So, that is it. Kudos to the Golden State Warriors. Kudos to Stephen Curry for winning the finals MVP. What, what you guys can say now, he has done it all. He has won the MVP. He has won... Two finals, uh, I would say two finals uh, victories without Kevin Durant. He's won the finals MVP and he, he's won the regular season MVP. Um, I don't think there's anything else for Stephen Curry to do. Now, the, the main thing is who is going to win their fifth title first between LeBron James and Stephen Curry. Me personally, I might be a little biased because I am a LeBron James fan, but I'm, ho I'm hoping, I'm hoping that LeBron James and Stephen Curry do find their way, do find their way on playing on the same team together. I would really appreciate it. I know a lot of Golden State fans wouldn't like that, but I totally understand, you know, it's been a rivalry from 2015, so I totally understand that. But other than that, I just wanted to give you guys a heads up on what is happening right now. I do appreciate 
all the support i will be trying new content on the channel to see if you guys really enjoy it but um as you can see it is really hot in the bahamas the temperature is really hot constantly so if you guys like the warm weather and i guess that atmosphere where you could go to the beach and have fun that is the place where you guys do enjoy but uh, until then this is your boy Steph Fiat, and i am odia